Morning, you guys. Hello. It's game day. This is what I currently have on: romper, shoes, matching purse. Yeah. I did the mom thing to my daughter with her friends, and I was like, "You guys will miss this so much." Yeah. And I was like this is the best part of going out is yeah. getting ready together. Hi, girlfriend. Hi. Did you sleep good? I slept like a baby. Mm -hmm. I'm literally like a baby. Good. Okay, we have stopped by the house. We have dropped off some jerseys. We have picked up my jersey. That's so cute. I'm definitely gonna do a white skirt. Thought I might leave this on, but the skirt looks so cute. We've got some girls' boots and things so that people don't have to carry those in the restaurant. Hello? I don't know how to work in this car. What does this mean? I am so excited for this game. You have no idea. So the Titans actually came to Nashville from Texas. They used to be the Houston Oilers, fun fact. Nashville bought them in 2000 and they became the Tennessee Titans. This was the same year that Drake was born. So I'll like, I have such a vivid memory of this whole year, <laughs> truly. And after the Titans came in 2000, my Nana and I went to a game very shortly after that. We went to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus the Titans. And I was wearing the cutest little suede jacket I was so proud of. I never forget. Of course I remember my outfit. I love football games and I love the stadium. I think that they're like, they're definitely making and building a new stadium, but I guess that means they're tearing this one down, which is, I mean like, is 25 years a long time for a stadium? I don't feel like, I feel like stadiums should be built to last a little bit longer than that. Nashville has grown probably four, five times what it was in 2000, so I don't know. You already know what time it is. <laughs> this fan, this is my fourth handheld fan. Y'all have got to get these. This is the most compact one. It's not the most like one, you know, but it does the job. <laughs> this never gets old. Never ever. This will always be my favorite skyline. Once you get about halfway across the bridge, that's when you can start hearing the bachelorette screams from Broadway.
It's time! Oh, the AC. Yeah. The, oh, look at the screen so big. Oh my god. Crazy! But it was fun. And that was fun. Uh, we had a fun. good time. Fun. You want a hundred? You got it. Well, you're from you Vegas, girl. You have it. You have it. Yeah. It's in your blood. I want hundred and thirty-two. You want to? Oh, right. On that other game. Which game? Um, Dodgers. Look at you, girlies, girlies. Thank you for such a fun time, DraftKings. And just like that, the NFL season is officially here. I've partnered up with DraftKings Sportsbook, an official partner of the NFL, to bring new fans an exciting way to join in on the action. New customers can download the DraftKings app and use my promo code NASHVILLE. Bet $5 and boom, $200 in bonus bets hits your account instantly. So download DraftKings Sportsbook now and have fun cheering on your team this season. Protecting my peace for so long A little too good, now I'm so low Watching reruns of the same shows Almost everybody on my no-show Even with green lights, I don't go Never been sure, no, I don't know How does everybody else let go? January, Jenica, that made our New Year goals To find a good and solid morning routine Would be so proud of me for making my bed Without even any sheets on it because it's part of the routine, baby. We gotta get this chair cleaned out over here with these pillows and move on with our day. Like I know I could. Like I know. because you ate the muffins. I skipped breakfast this morning and only had some orange juice and now it's not even 11 and I'm ready for lunch. But I've accepted that I'm, I don't, I won't lunch food now and I think that I'm going to make those three cheeseburgers. Okay. But they're for me. I mean, if you want one and I have some tots, but now that you just said that you aren't hungry, I'm going to take them. Here's my personal dilemma. I woke up this morning mm -hmm. and my mind has not stopped racing. <laughs> My mind's not soft racing. Okay. Do you, need a, do you need a mental health day? I think I do. Okay. But I think the best way for me to go about this mm -hmm. is for me to... She can't just not be productive. No. That's not Even if she's on her deathbed, she'll be like, well, I guess I'll just... Vacuum. Yeah, bring me something I can do from the bed. Like, uh, it's crazy. I can't get her to relax for one second. Uh -uh. So I think I'm just going to tidy it. My door's broken. Come here. <gasps> Sure, sure as shit is. Oh, it's from this. Do, do, do. Whoopsies. Um, so I think I need to just tidy up here and then go out, out of the house. You're you're asking not to invite me. No. <laughs> I need to bebop around. Okay. I need to do I some have things. Four. 
Yeah, you gotta, that's a list. Yeah. I've I'll have to have something turned in by 2 Pacific, I mean 12 Pacific time, which is 2 here, so I kind of just want to eat and then get started on that. Okay. Um, so yeah, we're, hello, I'm Jenica. I'm Annika. Welcome to this vlog. <laughs> We, yeah. we're, we're kind of deciding what this vlog is going to be, but I think today my vibe is I'm ready to get the summer clothes out of the closet. I need to just reassess my closet because... I think you just did that. No. You did it, I guess, for summer, your summer wardrobe. Yeah, yeah, I did that, and now I just need to see all my clothes again, and there's perspective of what I can wear to work. Oh, yeah. That's now that what you I got, not, you don't need, yeah. like, school clothes, you need work clothes. Yeah, so that's what I need to see my closet through okay. the lens of. I am gonna go get some black jeans today. Okay, so we're... It's my cat. Hello? Please, lady. I am gonna go get some black jeans today. From Hollister? Probably. Mm -hmm. I have a little... <laughs> I like what? I have um, some built up rewards. Fun times. And the jeans, did you see them the other day when I wore them to work? How they were literally falling off me and I had to pin yeah. them in the back. Are you going to the Cool Springs one? Probably. Okay, good. I don't, I don't feel like you need to do all. No, no. Well, that one's the only one that has a holster. Oh, well, yeah. So. But I don't know if you're going to venture to Abercrombie or not. I don't think I'm going to. I don't think I'm going to have to get to that point today. Okay. So I think that'll make me feel better. And then in between me hanging out with Sophia, I'm going to come and I'm going to clean. Which that only gives me a short window to not get too much into a rabbit hole of um, like what I did the other day. And I cleared out every single cabinet that we have. Yeah, because then I have to go in and be like, what will she even do? Yeah, And I yeah. have to then clean up again. So, yeah. um, okay. So it sounded like we're going to reconvene at like dinner time. I mean, we'll see each other obviously throughout the day. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're going to be gone and I'm going to be working... Would you rather have the zucchini burgers or the oh, salmon tonight? Oh, my dilemma. My dilemma was okay. if I'm leaving right now, mm -hmm. I don't know when I'm going to be back, but I'm going to assume I'm going to be gone within the real lunchtime hour. So do I eat now or do I eat when I get back? But then it's like putting dinner in a weird position. Well, you're not ready if to I, leave right at this moment. So maybe well, make I'm that decision. Well, I'm only probably within the next 12 minutes. 12 minutes? <laughs> you're ready? I mean, I'm just going to put a different top on, but yeah. I gotta prepare an hour to get out of this I know, house. I know, I know. I gotta mentally, physically. I'm not gonna put any makeup on. I'm, my hair's great. Your hair's great. She <laughs> got her hair done, you guys. My hair's look. great. That's crazy. That? Yeah, it looks great. It's, you just did a darker gloss. I posted a YouTube video and a TikTok today. Heck yeah, girl. What so, you? that you never watch. Thank you. I know, I'm sorry. I, I didn't, you told me about Wednesday and it's just, it's Wednesday. I'm ready to watch it now. Well, it you can Wednesday. with the rest of the world. It is Wednesday. Okay. All right. Well, I'm gonna go make these burgers. Burgers. That's literally the first thing I said to you. <laughs> I thought you meant the turkey burgers. No. I'm, so oh. what are we doing for dinner? Oh, well, then I guess we probably need to say that. Well, we don't have a different vibe. <laughs> well, this I've actually six been learning. Times a day. I've actually. It's been so fun, like learning the phases of my cycle and seeing like what foods are best mm -hmm. for me. And right now it is like red meat beef, so it makes sense that I'm craving burgers. Well. We had this conversation yesterday also, and I said I was going to eat my tuna salad wrap yeah. for lunch and Do the that. factor for dinner. Well, go ahead. You need to eat it. You can take your wrap in your lunchbox with you and sit in a parking lot somewhere and eat it. Point! Point! Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we have a little ice pack and everything. You could just go wherever you want. Have your little I got a tray and everything. You got a tray and everything. What? what tray? <laughs> Do you know somebody in your past life named Trey? She's getting hyped for Tr this. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my gosh. Do y'all want to see my um, closet? I'm not entirely sure how that happened. It'll be alright. It'll be alright. and I've not recovered. So you gave me the eyebrow appointment. It was not it was not up for discussion, I don't think. It was. Out of the kindness of my heart, I knew it wasn't. Um 
so should I put on a short? You'll be fine. Are you gonna go on a freaking hike? Maybe. Never know. Like if you were gonna be walking around outside, then it would be a different story, but you're not, you're, you're driving around outside. I don't even love the way these fit me. Then change. Maybe that was the issue with the other top you had on. I think it was. But what would I change into? Well, you don't like biker shorts. Go put just some of your shorts on. Just your little flowy shorts that you have. You got about 300, and you got about 300 shirts to match any of them, so. Let's carry on. I'm using my brain. I'm trying to okay. visualize. You got it. You come with you me. Got it. They're coming with me. I wonder what I'm going to walk out in. What do we think? Oh, it's gorgeous. That match is perfect. That match is great. It's like a little bit oversized. Oh, fun. Look at those colors, I girlfriend. Know, right? Okay. Lunch was so good. Before I sit down for work, I did just get a package, and one of them is PR, so I thought I'd open them with you guys. I did get my Puras for this month. This is like my transitional to fall, like this, because I ordered these in like the beginning of August, or I, I think I switched these over after my last summer round, and I wasn't ready for like pumpkin spice just yet. So, fellow Pura girlies, what are your favorite fall Pure sense. I feel like last year I did like a pumpkin dulce or something that I loved. I'd have to look at my history, but I want some like, I want fall AF sense, okay? This one, I probably get this one almost every single time. It's just, y'all know, y'all know at this point, Capri Blue Volcano Candle. I mean, it's just, it's just one of the greatest scents in the world. Next up, we have also gotten this one before. This one is a favorite and I love this one in the living room. It's Sandalwood Dark Amber and Soft Musk. It's called Soho by Guy Fox. Next up, these are two new ones I'm very excited about. So we have two Puras, one that's like over by the cat litter and also the living room. It's kind of the in between both of those things. And so that one I like to have more like living room-ish scents. Um, I probably will put definitely the Soho and either the Volcano. The Volcano I like in the, in the entryway sometimes or this Fern Moss, but for the other one, it is in the like very front entryway and it's also like right where our laundry room is. So I just like when people to come in, I want it to be like a good, fresh, clean scent, you know? For that one, I got Linens and Surf and this is just by Pura. I'm really excited to smell this one actually. Nice, okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's, kind of, it's, it's kind of like a, it's kind of coconutty. It's linen and clean, but with the faintest coconut scent. I really like that. That's gonna be nice in the front yard. Okay, uh, front yard. In the front, like the foyer. Okay, next up is from Brooklyn Candle Studio, and it is Fern and Moss, and it's Sage, Lavender, Spruce, Pine, and Oak Moss. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So do we want this in the, in the entryway, or do we want this in the living room? I'm gonna throw up. This is so wonderful. Oh my god, it's got the tiniest, scent of Christmas. The spruce and the pine, obviously. Like, that's the lavender and the sage. Y'all, I think, I think we'll do living room for this one. I think we'll do living room just because Annika also has been using a lavender um, scented cleaning thing. And so the lavender might pair over there. And then we'll put the volcano in the front as well. Next up, I have been wanting to try this brand for so long, so I really am so excited. I was not expecting this. This is a surprise. Like sometimes brands will DM you, and then sometimes I don't, they guess go to your management or find it from. I'm sure there's like a form somewhere. This is Peaks BT Fountain Beauty Electrolyte Mix. How fun! I'm always looking for new fun ways to get in my electrolytes, and this one's a yuzu berry flavor. Hyaluronic acid, youthful skin, deep hydration, sign me up. Next up, I need y'all's help because I really genuinely, to my core, know that I could be a matcha girly. I know I could like matcha, and I know that I would like matcha. I just don't know how to do it, and I feel like it's something, I don't know, like I, I've had a couple like out that I've, that I've liked, but I don't know anything enough about it to like, be able to make it myself at home and I that, that's where I want to get. Look at a little frother! How cute! 
so please either leave me your matcha rest okay this is what i i'm not gonna want it to be like earthy but i'm not gonna want it to be super sweet either <laughs> Like, obviously, I can do maybe a little bit of what you do, almond milk, or, like, maybe I can foam some almond milk at the top, but I do want it to just be, I don't know, oh, you can do cold, too, organic ceremonial grade matcha from Japan. Like, I know that I love this. I just need to know how. And then we have a gorgeous frother. Oh, I like this one because you just sit it. Like, it doesn't have to, the other one we have is, like, you have to hang it. I like that you just would have to sit this one. Nice! Oh, and it's got the logo. How fun. Okay. Luna just went in my room looking for me. Tins, where's your toy? Where's your toy? I can't throw it if you don't bring it. <laughs> it oh, okay. Here. Here. Drop it. Hey, no, no, no. Drop it. Tuna. No, I'm not playing that game. Oh, she said, well, me neither then. Okay, I think I've decided that I am going to start with my dresser because we've got things are discombobulated in there. Like the pajama drawer is filled with biker shorts and the biker short drawer is filled with sports bras. So we need to, of course she brings it right here. Um, so we need to deal with that, I think, first before we switch over to clothes because it's still so hot that a lot of the clothes I do need, I just, I'm getting rid of like the springy, bright, color summer stuff and I really just don't have I need to be able to bring at least one box of my like fall ish cup I'm like not sitting very ladylike sorry about that guys anyway um so I just need to be able to get at least a couple things I do have like a really cute short sleeve Halloween t-shirt like all my like all of my fall all my fall stuff is put away so gonna make room at least enough for that but it's just unfortunate because it is so hot that I can't get rid of all of my summer stuff so we'll see we'll see how it goes oh hi um, but I think I'm going to do drawers. I'm going to do drawers. You're starting closet right now. Yeah. I'm going to do my, my drawers, though. And I might make it to the closet today. If not, that'll be a tomorrow task. Or it could be a Friday task on the work. Well, what does that have to do with me? <laughs> right now, you're doing dishes. What do you want to do? I'm talking about tomorrow. Oh. Okay, we'll see. Maybe I'll get to it today. Nice. <laughs> nice. I wish I could film from this angle more, but it just, there's so much sunlight coming in right there and there's nothing coming in from right there that it does, you can see where the sunlight stops. Okay. Can you tell we're procrastinating? No, I want to do this. I want to get, the, no, I don't. <laughs> I tried to make myself think I do. I just get frustrated with those, like, my, like, workout clothes because there's so many things in there that I should probably get rid of. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to assess. If you haven't worn it in the last three months, it has to go. Three months? Yes. No, I don't think that's the rule. That's too much. A year. No. It's season. Yeah, if you haven't, if you didn't wear it in a whole, like a seasonal situation. If you didn't wear it in the season you were just in that you were supposed to wear it, it goes. Well, no, sometimes you just don't get around to things. And that's how it's got to go. Nah. I will say that my pajama situation is, I feel like I go through phases of what I like to sleep in. And you do. You do. Maybe it just looks a lot like one of your mini nightgowns. Yeah, I have nightgowns, okay? Because nighties. Once you become a mom, you get nightgowns. It's just what happens and honestly I love it. Who wouldn't want it's just like a big t shirt, basically, but softer material. Mm, I'd rather wear a t shirt. Well you'll get to your nightgown phase one day. Don't you worry. If that's insinuating that I'm gonna become a mother. I'm just saying I think everybody hits an age where they stop caring about the t-shirt and start caring about the comfort level. I'm not sending Snapchats to anybody once I put my nightgown on. I'm not either. <laughs> I have a time limit of five minutes on Snapchat a day. And you know how, that's not that's before I get out of bed. Well, no. She can get other streaks and gets out. That is still untrue. I have not one streak. Do you not? No. Congratulations. Honestly, that's gross. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I get on maybe once a day to see where people are at, and then I get off. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. I don't that, I'm so glad that tool did not exist for now, because I would have been I would have been in the know of where everybody was at all times. I don't use Snapchat Sophia anymore, unless I got to start something. Yeah. But other than that, I message. Okay, well. I guess let's go to work. I'm gonna, I wish I could just show you all Weasley right now because he's but so cute, straight but it's just view. straight view. We will be showing you our view when, once we leave, don't you We'll worry. give you a whole tour Yeah, we'll give you a whole, like, a, apartment. and everything. Yeah. Okay. You want to help me with this? No. 
Not in the least. Okay, I'm gonna be doing my underwear first. So I'm just simply not gonna hold up underwear and go through it with you guys. The only thing I'll say about underwear is I have a lot, I have found, I feel like, some adults' underwear that I like. Because I did, unfortunately, have to graduate from the Victoria's Secret Pink 5 for 25. I think it's like 5 for 35 now, but we got the 5 for 25. And I'm telling you, some of those are still in here. So, I've been upgrading to woman underwear, okay? And my favorite, favorite, favorite by far is this set from Amazon. It's a set of five. And it's like, I'll try to be inconspicuous with the... <laughs> but the material is this really nice, like, stretchy spandexy. I have it in the thong version. I think it comes in other ones. I really need to get it in like a lot of different ones. But yeah, it comes with five and it's great and it's on my Amazon shop and I love it. They're my favorite. I do have these from Revolve. How cute are these? I mean, come on. I don't know what made me just add these to the cart, but I was like, I just, I just have to have those simply. Okay. Anyway, was that too much? I mean, you can't tell. I mean, come on, you know, right? Surely not. Okay. I'm going to deal with this. Okay, we're just gonna pretend like these are swimsuit bottoms because these are my favorite, like non thong, comfy. These are the ones I go to when I'm, you know, on my period or just feeling like I don't have to wear a thong, you know? So, here they are. They're the Skims cotton ones, but look how stretchy, y'all. And they just feel like I'm wearing pajamas. Like when I have these on, I like to sleep in these a lot of times too because they just feel literally so soft. Now, you can see it is a, um, like you can see the seam, it's not as seamless. But these are just like my comfy go-tos. Well, I was just about to show you guys how much more organized this guy was. And I got a, I got a friend. Ooh. Drawer number two, look how gorgeous. I'm on my sock drawer now. And this is a pair of socks that I will never get rid of. And I hope I never, ever, ever lose my middle school cheerleading socks. Look at that, how funny. This is when you like everything had to match. So our socks matched our uniform. I mean, this is a good pair of freaking socks if I've been able to wear it all these years with no holes. Look at that. And then these even were my high school colors too. So I wore these all through high school and cheered in these as well. How crazy. So I've literally had these since I was Annika, since I was younger than Annika. Wild. Socks are done. Biker shorts, yoga pants, leggings, tennis booty. <laughs> okay, there are still some things I need to assess, but you guys, we have a whole open drawer with nothing in it. I am in need of some more swimsuit space, so I might make a swimsuit drawer, but we have a whole empty drawer, you guys, and these were overfilling. Well, I was coming in here to get an Olipop or some fun little drink, and I decided that I wanted to try these guys. I'm excited. I like to just do a little bit of ice and a little bit of water first. I'm thinking Annika may really like these too because she she loves putting anything in water. Okay, now some more ice and water. Look at the little pink tint. So cute. Oh, this is beautiful. Cute. And she matches the straw. I saw it said berry, and so I said, let me just grab that berry straw. These are from Amazon, by the way. Mmm, very subtle. This is good. This is, I like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What does it taste like? It's so, it really is a faint taste. Definitely berry. But I feel like it's a little bit tart. Nice. I have switched the laundry over. I'm washing all my sheets and the blankets and stuff on my bed. So I'm switching all of that over. And then... We have to take turns on a WAL. Okay. I think that I, well, how what degrees is it? 82. 82. Okay, maybe I could either do a long walk and that be it, or I could do a shorter walk, her go to the park for a tiny bit, and then may go to the gym for a tiny bit and split. I feel like I should just do a, a walk. Maybe I'll wait 30 more minutes. No, I need to go while the, uh, while Annika's still not home and I need to, okay, let's go. Let's go on it. Did you hear that? Would you like to go on a walk? Come here. Come here. Come here. Would you like to go on a walk? You want to go on a walk? Let's go. Come out and play. It's Saturday. And I promise I'll love you much better now. The sour taste will wash away. Because I promise you.
Oh, his ears are so far back. He wants to play. He wants to play. Won't you love me? Won't you love me? Won't you love me? Love me like yesterday. Don't you feel? It's not great. My hair doesn't no, it's smell it. Mm. It's the baby more stuff. Nice. The serum? Yeah. Nice. Did you put my pillows that I'm about to put my head on on the floor? Where our animals just sit the best time in the world? freaking clean pillows. My freaking clean pillow. Hello you guys. Sorry we've not picked up camera it's literally since this morning and I've been behind the camera and she did schoolwork all day. I said you know what I'm gonna just do it. I'm gonna just do it. Yeah she went outside by the pool. There's it's like a cabana situation. It. It yeah. Really is, it's still home so if I need anything I really it's like I can go back up and get it. Yeah. And it's just for those they have like cushions. And yeah. It's just a nice setup. Yeah. I got a DM from Isle Paradise at the beginning of the week, and they put this out fast. But if it's the butter, I'm gonna cry. Really? If it's the butter, I'm gonna. I cry. like the drops, but that's. I think the drops are the only thing that I've ever tried from Isle Paradise. Brilliantly bright body moisturizer. Cute, cute, cute. Wait, what's it say at the bottom of it? Look at that drops. Skin. Oh, so maybe I only this have is a the lotion that you put this. Oh, the, cool. the, yeah. So this is what I do have. I use them on my that face. Is such a big. Bottle. I know. I, I've never had a bottle this big. I usually just get the little tester guys, but I use it for my face a lot. Mm -hmm. Love. Those are oh, that's gonna be nice. We really do like Isle of Paradise a lot. These drops are just so convenient if you want a nice, good, even tan. But also if you just want a particular part of you to yeah. like not having to do the whole thing. Yeah. Like yeah. Right down. I also got a package in. If you didn't see, I think it was just maybe one or two videos I talked about it on my channel because I just yeah. couldn't talk about it without crying. I had. It's okay. It's okay. You don't have. It's okay. I knew this would happen. Um, we were also both just thinking about it yesterday. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like we both just had a conversation about him yesterday. So I had a really close friend of mine pass away this summer. Um, it not so in a in a very tragic accident like it was very sudden it wasn't it just wasn't supposed to happen so his family did like a park and line with a somewhat local yeah i would say local like print t-shirt print shop yeah and so if there's one thing we're merch girlies and when it came to this i said sign me up yes yes so i got my first car sticker awesome. it's, i'm gonna put it on the white so it's it like white on white so it's sleek it says love like parker and it has a little like icon of him skating. And then he has two sisters and one of them's like a sorority girl in her college and I know she did a great job designing these. When I saw this, I knew I had to have it. The green on red is so him. Like I can't even explain it. It's and it so just cute. says it's, LLP for Love Like Parker. It's got little hearts. Let me see the Yeah, it's like red hearts on the green. I really love the co so color cute. combination. So that's why I got this one. It really looked, I mean, he it's would totally wear that. so cool. And then I got this one that has his little like figure on it with his signature on the bottom. His signature was it's so, so cool. funny. It was weird to watch his signature like grow because when <laughs> it, we were in middle school, he'd do like the stick letters. Like the top of the P was literally a triangle. And then it got to be kind of cute. So his signature. And then the one we obviously had to get is a little black crop top with a camera on it. I mean, how freaking cute. And then it has his initials, Parker Glenn Nugent. We had to. Because so. he was always behind the camera. He was, oh my, in all the football games, he took all the pictures. He gave me the camera at one point and I was taking pictures for him. He's like, don't take a million though. I took a million. So yeah, got this. And then I also just want to say thank you to Table Rock for sending me this book of Annabelle. She is also one of my friends that passed away this summer through a disease that she had and her family's done a great job of bringing awareness to it. She had epilepsy, it caused another very tragic passing away, it was just awful. And so they did this little book, she was a table rock girly, she loved nothing more than creating content and they just did a little, all of her different friends that went on different trips with her and just became friends with her through the table rock, they did a little picture collage and this is a job that you just like connect with people so quickly because yeah. you're sharing like you're all immediately keeping up with each other's lives and she's so personal and she was like I feel like the, she was the girl on y'all's trip that was really like yeah my kept all together you know she made us all feel comfortable and always was the first to have an icebreaker or a funny comment to bring us more together literally exactly what you just said so one dollar for the table 
I also got these sour gummies, but unfortunately they're went on boxing because they're already, I've already had 10. And we got them 36 seconds ago. They're, would you say that these are my favorite thing? And I don't even get the hype. I don't understand how. It's literally like if it was pink and red Starburst. Sour Punch, Sour Punch Kids, Sour Patch Kids. What is it? Sour Patch. Sour Patch Kids. They're Sour Punch Straws. Yeah, one of the two. Mm. You're forgetting to leave it out though. They give you the worst stomach pains. That's when I go overboard. I like to reel it in. Let me close in the bag. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. They hurt your stomach. Some things are worth it, honey. <laughs> are really the best beauty blenders. This line is so good. This is one of the first things that my skin girly recommended to me. This is what my cheerleading days smelled like. Like I can smell this and just smell high school. Oh my gosh, our Pop-Tart obsessed girly just found some Pop-Tart. Look at the colors too, what are they called? Okay, oh color. my god. This is so nice. Whoa. So cute. That's so cute. This is like pancakes. Oh my god. Woo! <laughs> now mall time. What are we looking for? This is another weird collab. Like Mountain High Outfitters. This is the only one I've ever seen in my life. Oh, and, and free, people. free people. Like a whole section. Interesting. What are we looking for in here so we can stay focused? Airy. Airy. Yes. Gotcha. Marley was a kit girl. I was Samantha. But Marley was kit. Who were you? Fun fact, this was the very first mall I ever came to because my mom came here four days after she had me. I think it was, no, after Marley. Maybe it was me. So she just loved this she, mall. We were at this she mall every Saturday growing up. For mall. real. On the streets of New York City, headed up town. You're just looking for an excuse to be able to buy another New York shirt. Oh, look behind you. <laughs> Miss Lady Liberty herself, she has got her bra. She's taking her bra off. She said free the nipple. You go, girl, honestly. I kind of love that. This is another reason we limit ourselves to only coming in the store a few times. My favorite Skims bra. Literally looks exactly like this. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I love it. It's my favorite bra. Do you want the black, pink? What color? The nude. Nude? Yeah. This is almost like the waffle that I have that I love from here, but like fleece. Let's see. It's very cute. Come here, let me see. It matches your shoes. It's very cute. We're in H&M now. These are the closest I found to my favorite thrift pants. These are so cute. They're, and I can say they're giving Urban Outfitters. And then this, look how cute this is. Neither one of our boobies. Oh my God, you were just talking about you never see anything UCLA. Okay, well that's cute. That's very cute. <laughs> wow. Hello. I just put this slip gloss on. Look how gorgeous. Okay. And then this is what I really want to try. This, I'll do a haul when we get home, but this elf stick. I've been really liking shadow, liquid shadows and shadows that are just easy to play with. So I wanted beer on my phone, like selfie styles. So, so. Yeah. I, where do you, you look right here when yeah. you're, but that's just so hard to look at. I think it also is better if you look at the screen. You do? Yeah. Oh, yeah. what? You do? Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see how this goes. So really, it, you're, you're able to be messy with it. I guess I should have done one eye before I committed to both. Really it's so up close and personal. Like this is so not wide lens. We have to have 0.5 for the front camera. Like it's got to be done. Huh? Yeah, it looks great. It looks just very natural. Well, what did I get? It's Can you see? Box. Can you see? I think maybe you need to do a lot more, like a little bit thicker. Well, it's also front camera, so at the end of the day. It's I not going to be the best. I got moisturizer because it's been out for a hot minute and I definitely can tell with my skin. It's just not as... I think this advertises as like creating a skin barrier and I can definitely tell. Yeah, she, as soon as she was... She, how long have you been out of that? Maybe like a month. Yeah. And I've been trying to use the CeraVe Nighttime and it works, but it's just like it doesn't give what I need to get. It's too thin almost. 
so I got this one again. I was going to do the purple because it was cuter, but then I was realistic and decided not to. And then we're both going to try out the Goldie Drops. Yeah. We haven't tried these out, but they gave you me a nice shine when I tried them on my... Oh, yeah, they were beautiful. I just put this all over my... Like, all over the lid, and I feel like I like it even better. Yeah, no, yeah. Yeah. I've not really been this excited. Like, I usually just don't even... I have my Mario palette that I'll use, but, like, I don't even get excited about eyeshadow anymore. I got this makeup by... Yeah, Ariel. Ariel. This is one of the Sponge. best sponges. The, this one, I ended up getting this two pack because it's got a like. Oh, some, nice. Yeah, how nice is that? Nice. These are the only two sponges I would ever have in my collection. TV. Well, it's I'm also the best that I've tried. I'm not trying them all, yeah, okay? But, but these guys, this so good. This cute. Yeah. I use a sponge for everything. My foundation, my concealer, my everything. What else is it? Yes. Okay, this is one of the things that I did go in there for. I needed a pencil. I have liquid eyeliner, but I'm out of my black and brown pencil eyeliner. And I feel like, ooh. Oh, are you okay? You working now? We were just we talking do about nails tonight. Let's do that. We don't have if our nails are or if they're if there's not I have work tomorrow. We have to do my nails tonight. Okay, well I'll skip my nails tonight. I think my nails maybe need a look at these guys. Um, look at this blush. Yeah, we were not even. We were just. We saw that, and I put a little bit on my hand, and Anna was it like, on? "Yeah, put it on." Sure. Maybe you don't use yeah use two fingers so you can control it a little bit more. There. And also when I have my blush brush, it'll be a lot better. Go up a little bit more like yeah. Look how cute! Oh that is cute. It's very like glowy and like dewy. It's it's yeah, a cream. That's what I look is it, for. Is it No, it was like a It's this Maracuja like line that they have and they have a real like I have the um lip gloss of the, or like lip plump of this. It's really good glowy. What do we think? I think it's great. Yeah, that looks great. That looks really nice. That looks really nice. And it's, I've been wanting a new, like, pink one for work. Yeah. Oh, I got another one of the shadow sticks. This one is just a brown. So this one was called Copper. This is the one I wanted, like, I mean, you wouldn't think that. I stayed away from the Glossier one that's this color, and I kept, every time I use my, like, silver and pink ones, I'm like, I feel like I should have had a brown one. So this one's more of a copper, and then this is brown. It's called Cool Beans. We got a moon dust. Um... Mom uses this on her eyes religiously, and it literally makes it look so glowy. It like, I feel like when you have no makeup on, your lids are kind of shiny, and as soon as you put makeup on, it like mats it down. Yeah. And you can just tell. And then if you add a little bit of shimmer back in the crease, it really makes it yeah. look like. I feel like for natural. my day to day, I've been doing some my like my if I'm doing my makeup, I'll use my Mario palette. But like just my day to day, I've been using the Glossier Lid Star, and it's like a cream one. And then I'll put just I like kind of almost set it with that. Um, Moon Dust from Urban Decay. It's so good. We have Cosmic and then this is Space Cowboy. Space and Cowboy. I think that Space Cowboy is going to be my favorite. But it's going to live in my room. Yeah. Okay. This is the lip gloss I have on. It's freaking crazy, you guys. It's like this insane iridescent. Like, uh -huh. it's so pretty. I just filmed a, a makeup phase on TikTok and now Look I got this new blush. Like, what am I supposed to do? Okay. And then lastly, I needed another one of these guys. I have I literally, oh, here she is. We got in the car now immediately. She's empty. She's empty. Wow, this blush is cute. That blush is really cute. Did I get anything? I, I really like this. Um, I hope I got the berry. I thought this one was the berry. Cause yeah, berry blush. This one's my favorite scent. My favorite this. is Rainwater. Yeah, that one's a good one too. And then we got, do y'all remember when we got that little shampoo conditioner? trio of this yeah it ended up being a texture spray which mm -hmm. i do love and i do have and i do need this is dry shampoo the advanced clean though this right here this advanced clean dry, i don't know what they put in this listen i will say i recently became a vega more girly oh yeah and this stuff like even if i would have gone to ulta or wherever i don't know if they're selling stores but if even if i would have purchased it myself and not been like sent it i would have being obsessed it smells, so it smells insane yeah. like insane i kept so walking good. like through like breezes and stuff be like what's that smell and it was literally my hair, hair. <laughs> it was crazy the dry shampoo and the um hair serum smell Fantastic. crazy yeah i have a code coming soon so yeah. um and then the, the serum is is like what do you think that scent is it's 
It's so good. You know that hair stuff that just like, I feel like there's certain scents like for me. It's almost like it's it's better than hair salon scents. Yeah, for me, Biolage or however you say it, like that is that was like the scent of my mom's hair salon growing up. So like when I smell that, I'm in a 90s hair salon and I mean, I could have a candle in that stuff. I used it for a long time just because of the scent of it. I loved the scent so much. This is better. Yeah, this is a good one. Okay, lastly, this is the brown. I got a black pencil in there somewhere, and then I had to get the, I got the black um, elf one, and they were out of brown for elf, so I got this NYX pencil eyeliner, and then this was as, at the checkout, and I just love stuff like this. Again, as you'll say, I'm becoming a liquid shadow girly. Can I put, can I put this on you? It almost looks exactly like the lips. Oh, me? Yeah. Can I? Sure. Close your eyes. You might need to blend it a little bit more, but pretty. I don't love. It's orange. What do you mean? Right? How did it come out pink and orange on you and it's silver and blue in here? I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, it's orange. It's oh, lit. Put it on me. Hold on. Let me take a picture. Oh, I mean, I can see. With your eyes closed? <laughs> There's a, a such thing as one eye open. <laughs> I don't like right? the feeling in your eyes. Come on. I don't like it. <laughs> You're gonna hug my freaking eye out. I, I'm gonna be able to do it. I, I, you, you get, I got it. That is funny. It's green. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm confused. Maybe it's the stuff we've got on underneath. I have nothing. Okay, let me see this, right? It's silver. I guess it kind of does, like, have a little green, green tint to it when you're... But, like, orange. Orange. It's so green. It's not, like, blue at all. Now that I know what to expect, though, still, like, I'll be able to use it. I, I just thought it was going to be... Don't love. Don't love. So, the options are salmon any flavor we can do salmon and like pasta or like salmon and rice or salmon and macaroni and cheese like teriyaki or we can do salmon and fried rice dual bowls or we could do the zucchini burgers and tots or we could do the spaghetti meatballs and i have those ready for you one of my favorite things to put on salmon. Honestly, most flavors I've tried from this brand is really good, but the island teriyaki is my favorite. It's got like a little pineapple kick. Teriyaki, some soy sauce, and maybe a little something of this. I feel like that would be good crust on. Okay. Thanks, Mom. You're welcome. <laughs> How is it? some camera issues we've got one camera that the body has stopped so like the actual camera part of it has stopped turning on it it turns on every now and then and it's the one that I got in 2020 that like literally changed your life so I'm having a hard time coming to terms with that maybe being done and then the Sony we just don't we need a wider lens if that's gonna be like the main camera for now. So we both been working. Annika's actually just got off work. She just is pulling up to pick me up now and we are going to dinner with Maddie and Austin tonight. I have on this dress from Amazon. Boop, boop, boop. You can kind of see through at the bottom, obviously. You can see the legs moving, but you can't see through anything right here. It's really pretty. The back has got like a cutout. I just, I put on a pink sharples bra because I was like, mm, I, don't, I don't feel like just putting sticky boobs on tonight. So, fun, huh? AJ's making a TikTok. Is there somebody pulling? There's somebody pulling next to me. Homeboy just pulled up. <laughs> Come on, girl, you got it. 
Come on, Jane, do your thing. Oh, she's ready. It's been a long time coming, okay. So it's a Taylor Swift. <laughs> okay, y'all can watch me watch her. I can't wait to see Maddie. I can't wait to see Maddie. Cutie. Little fit check. Okay, she's doing a fit check. Little. Uh huh. It was to the sound. It's been a long time coming. Cute. Very cute. <laughs> Annika, are you okay? No, that even looks good. Like, you have it Yeah, no, that kind of sounds good. Mm. Good choices, guys. Good choices. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at this, though. What just... Yum. Yum. Yeah, I'm not saying. 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 I'm not saying